What up? Welcome back. It's your girl, Cook Steez, Cook Low, Cook Bees, Cook Ease. You already know how I'm rocking back at it again with another video. I'm so excited today. In my last video, I gave you a hint of what we were filming today. Um, so let's just hop into it. And this has been saved in my phone for a very long time. I gave you a hint. So today I'm going to try to do my makeup using only the paintbrushes. I cheated and did my brows, but like I don't feel like it's cheating because I usually use a brow pencil anyway for my brows. So it's not like I was really going to, you know. But everything else I'm going to try to do with these brushes. I feel like we're going to need as much help as we can get. So I'm going to use the Milk Hydro Grip uh, as a primer because I feel like we're going to need some help. Oh, and um... When I take this bandana off at the end of this video, don't come from my edges, don't come from my baby hairs, like. So since the goal is to try to do my makeup as, like, as normal as possible and as close, like, I'm not trying to make this look bad, I'm just gonna throw that out there. I'm gonna really try to pull this off. Now that I did my primer, normally I would go in with, um, a sponge and do my foundation. This is the closest thing in the bag to a sponge. So... Let's let's see. Let's get it popping. Because I'm not sure how this is gonna work out. I'm gonna try to do as much full coverage as possible. Um, I'm gonna use the Too Faced Born this way. This is in the shade Maple, and um, this is a pretty buildable foundation. So I feel like this is this is safe. <laughs> I'm gonna pump some of that on the back of my hand, and um, I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. Okay okay um not terrible it doesn't cover that much space at one time so i really have to work in sections but okay i'm sorry if you guys can hear that it's raining but it's supposed to rain until june 1st so what am i supposed to do not film Ooh, ooh, ooh. okay okay i don't know if it's just me but i feel like I feel like we seeing some things. I'm so nervous. I probably should have done my eyes first. All right, I'm gonna do my eyes after I do this. That way I can just conceal whatever, whatever I need to, <laughs> in case it gets crazy. Yeah. So that was two pumps. I feel like this is eating my foundation. Probably the sh probably should have done it with something from the drugstore. <laughs> because I feel like I'm wasting so much foundation. Maybe if I sweep it on. And then blend it out. Okay, wait, yeah, wait a minute now. We might be onto something. I'm feeling real airbrushed. Get all up in there. I'm nervous. I am so nervous, okay. I used to think this wasn't my shade. I mean, it still might not be. It depends on the day. But I do have to remember that this kind of, this foundation oxidizes a little bit. And when it dries down, it does really look like skin. Like, okay, um, that's not awful. I was expecting way worse. Well, I don't know what I was expecting. It's like brushes are brushes, but like, they're different materials, you know. Yeah, I already know I'm taking Too Faced Born This Way Multi Sculpt. I'm gonna put that on my eyes. I, I think this brush, it's pretty flat. I think I can use that to kind of like carve out my eyes. I don't know about <laughs> blending, but I can kind of use that. Oh. Ooh, I need to get closer. What am I doing? I don't have no control of this brush. All right, yeah, we're gonna have to switch gears on that one. We're gonna use this little fluffy brush and um, try to blend that out some. I mean, I'm not gonna say it's not working <laughs> because, I mean, clearly something's happening. I just am not sure what is yet. <sighs> okay, okay. It is not awful. No, like, I feel like, you guys, it's not, it's not bad, right? <laughs> I mean, would I go out? Probably not. I mean, maybe. I don't know. We gotta see what it looks like at the end. I mean, 
an idiot. I had foundation all over the back of my hand and I just rubbed my back and now it's like <gasps> all over my hand. All over my back, obviously. So I don't know if you guys have seen it, but there's this whole color poppy black movement going on right now. Um, started by I ooh, okay. Now, do I know these people personally? No. Do they even know who I am? No. But um, according to their Twitter names, it is Neon MUA and Killer King with a shitload of G's. And, um, and basically they're just calling out ColourPop. Like, we understand that you know black people exist because you're inclusive. But like, also, your page doesn't show it. Like, if you go to their Insta like if you go to their Instagram, it is literally like a sea of salt, mayonnaise. It's like a sea of salt, butter, mayonnaise, and maybe like one fleck of pepper, if you get what I'm saying. So in support of that, I am going to use a ColourPop palette, and um, that way I can use the hashtag. I'm going to use the Kathleen Lights Dream Street palette. Um, don't come for me. Obviously, this is an older palette, uh, <laughs> but she's just so pretty, okay? And like, I don't know, I'm feeling, I'm feeling excited. I'm... This palette is is getting me is getting me hyped up. So I'm gonna use this 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 pinky coral shade right here, and this is like a little fluffy brush. I don't. Maybe I should have went in bigger. Ooh. Okay. Hold on. Wait. Let me blend that out because we got a little creasing happening. All right. I'm just gonna like sweep that into my crease and see where oh and see what happens oh precision okay i see you precision i see you and then i'm gonna just draw this up and start to create my wing okay wait see we getting a little patchy now yeah, if I pull this off, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm gonna be so gassed. Y'all probably won't be able to send me that thing. Okay, that's actually not bad. Like, at all. Nah, B, that's actually really not that bad. Okay. Those don't look even at all. Okay. I'm just kind of blend that out and up so it's not so harsh. We're literally painting my face like this is crazy i'm gonna take this really skinny like liner brush and i'm gonna take this dark brown right here and just kind of like focus that on the outer oh oh definitely a little bit of tug happening but uh the precision is there okay so I definitely feel like I'm testing my luck, but we're going to take one of these flat brushes again. And I'm going to go in with this shade down here in the corner. Ooh. Oh, oh, okay. All right, we're going to cut this crease. Hmm. Thoughts are still out. <laughs> And then taking taking one of the fluffy brushes from earlier, I honestly don't think it matters which one. <laughs> I'm just gonna blend that out a little bit. Um. Hmm. And then going back in with the bigger fluffy brush, I'm gonna use this really really deep turquoise, almost black, on the outside. And just kind of drag it into my crease okay those two shadows blend together so nicely stop stop oh my god i'm getting so gassed like i think i'm really about to pull this off stop playing put some respect on my name nah i am gassed y'all really can't tell me that thing I really can't tell me nothing. All right, um, I'm gonna get a skinnier brush and I'm gonna take that brown first and I'm just gonna kind of like sweep under my eyes. I'm trying to blind a bit. 
and then that that turquoisey color uh on top of that blimey baby with your neon lights if you go to heaven and they take me to hell just you gotta meet me with a box of elves nah real shit <laughs> real shit <laughs> Deadass. That's the, that's the type of energy I'm on. <laughs> Sneak out at BB with a box of L's. Sneak out of heaven and bring me some. Sneak out of heaven and bring me some gas. Do you hear me? <laughs> now this could actually be a whole moment. Okay, let's 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 do concealer and finish off the rest of my face, and then we'll come back to the eyes. Okay, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take the same the same one from earlier. I'm gonna let that sit because I needed to. <laughs> I'm gonna let that sit because I needed to pack. Uh, all right so while i wait i'm gonna do my lashes um this is the covergirl total tease mascara um i'm gonna let that dry i'm gonna i'm just letting everything dry <laughs> okay i'm gonna blend I'm, I'm so scared i'm so scared all right let's do this let's do this this is that same um what's it call it this is the same one from earlier <laughs> oh my god I don't know what I was thinking. I just thought it would be cute. I thought it would be fun. It is fun. I'm having so much fun. <gasps> but why would I torture myself like this? I'm telling y'all, if I pull this off, don't, don't, don't say nothing to me. <laughs> don't say nothing to me. Don't talk to me. Don't look at me. Don't speak. Like, don't even think of me. <laughs> Coverage. Stop playing. Put some respect on who are these brushes by? Put some res put some respect on art skills, okay? Because this little uh 25 piece assorted paintbrushes pack did not come to play, okay? Points are really trying to be made right now. And I just alright, we're gonna use that to clean up. Yeah, we're gonna lift these eyes. We're gonna lift these eyes. Imagine though, if they made sponges like good quality sponges with handles. Oh, it would be a wrap. It would be a wrap. Okay. I don't think it's gonna get any more blended under there because I can't get the brush under there the way I want to do. Snatchery is happening, okay? Snatchery is definitely happening. Like, snatchery at its finest. It's like starting to lift my, my foundation, but like, I think it's just because of how hard I'm trying to push. Because I'm trying to like blend it out, but I can't. It's just a little too big. Like, I can't. It's the angle. Like, I can't get it where I want it to, to be. okay 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 i definitely need to set this i think i'm gonna take the dry one now because there's there's two sponges like that in here so i think i'm gonna take the dry one and try to set my under eye um this is the fenty beauty pro filter in honey you know my goat oh you know my go-to maybe i'm gonna have to use the wet one because are we picking up any product? I'm not sure we're picking up product. Okay, we're picking up product, but like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This is just that. <laughs> that it, Chief. I hate applying my powder like this. It's definitely getting in there though. Like, this is the side I set, and this is the side I didn't set. So it's, it's, it's doing something. It's just, I don't know. <gasps> okay, setting my face like this, it is definitely not it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Let's just, for the sake of saking, let's try one of the smaller brushes. I wish there was like at least one big brush in here though, so I could just like dust my whole face off. Like, that's the only thing I really need out of life right now. 
Maybe if I use this big brush, I could just pat my whole face in. I'm, I'm gonna put my lashes on off camera and then I will be right back to bronze and finish my face, I guess. I don't know what's left. I'm gonna take the Black Radiance um, Contour Complexion Palette and I'm going to bronze. Using the same one from before, I'm gonna use the uh, Contour and Sculpt in the palette. And uh, I'm just gonna kinda just stamp that in. Cause I'm a little scared. Oh, 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 see, oh, oh. And see, this is where this is where I took the third. Okay, let me just try to flick this up because bringing it down is just gonna pull my face apart. So let me just flick this up. Okay, I don't know whose award show I'm going to, but I'm gonna be ready for that. Bro, I'm telling you, wherever you put this, wherever you put this down, that's where it's gonna be, or be. Okay, maybe I just don't turn to the side. This one doesn't look awful. Maybe with blush it'll get better. But this side? Oh, honey. Maybe if I take the lighter shade, I can like... Okay. Um. Um. <laughs> this side really doesn't look as bad as it could. But this side is really just not feeling it. Like, I don't want to be a team player. I'm going to use the Watch Me Blush Palette from uh, the Crankcase. I can get it out. Okay. 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 Alright, wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. We might have something. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Now nah, we might have something. Okay. For just a little added warmth, I'm gonna use hot cocoa. And just ooh, 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 ooh. I should have dusted that off first. Okay. Alright, alright. I'm still not learning the lesson. That's cool. It really, alright. It doesn't look as bad as it could though. That's what's blowing me. Like, I could really go out and people would just think I'm having like an off. If you know me, you would think I'm just having like an off makeup day. If you didn't know me, you would be like, Zam, okay. I see you, beginner. <laughs> bow, 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 bow. I walk through. No, I'm getting hype. Okay. I'm going to use Tangerine, which is like this orange shade. I am addicted to this blush. Like, it's a nice, like, it comes off really, like, pretty and peachy. It's like an orange shade that like, you never knew you needed in your life. We'll see. Wait a minute. Now we're getting a little carried away. We could go into clown mode. Hold on. Don't worry. I wasn't there before. I'm not trying to go there now. Okay, honestly, guys, nah, don't even bother. I'm not even done. Don't bother. Don't bother. I'm going to use Sweet Tea from the Watch Me Blush Palette and just kind of like, I feel like this is a really pretty color and it goes very nicely with the shadow that I put in my crease. This palette is so multifunctional. Shout out to the crankcase. We love a multifunctional. The one thing I will say is this get this is using these brushes is giving so much texture. I just did, I mean, I know my face is already like textured, and I just did um I just used a peel from Pixie the last night, and then I did a face mask from uh Bare Minerals. So like I know my face was already like, you know, like exposed, expose. But like this is giving texture, like y'all yeah, see everything. Yes, this is not trying to blend out, like at all. It's okay to stop. Some of y'all was wearing your highlighter back in the day. Oh, some of y'all wear your highlighter now. All right. Um. Oh, there is some creasing. But I figured that was gonna be the case because I couldn't get the damn thing up close and personal no matter how i tried to angle it i just could not get the damn thing okay i'm gonna sweep a little bit more of that turquoise because i feel like it got a little lost for inner corner highlights 
I'm going to take this champagne-ish color right here and pop that in. And then on top of that, I'm going to use this one, this turquoise down here, because it's got the shimmer in it. And I'm just going to place that directly on top. But got a little carried away there. Directly on top. I'm over here really looking at it like there's something still not right. Like there's parts of this that are right. I mean, the eyes, the eyes snapped. I will give them that. The eyes snapped. The rest of the face, however, yeah. Not gonna lie, I just don't see it happening. I just need one big fluffy brush to dust my whole face. Like that's all I want right now. So I did my lips off camera. This is technically a brush though, so I feel like that counts. This is the NYX Lingerie Liquid Lipstick and this is the shade Beauty Mark. This is my go-to nude, like brownish nude lip. It's got like a hint of purple in it, but it is so pretty, like it's a daily, like it's a go-to, there's no liner. Like I, do you see this? Nah. I'm gonna use the Fenty Gloss Bomb and Confetti um just as like a lip topper just as like a lip topper and i'm gonna use this brush i put some of it on the back of my hand and i'm just, and I'm just gonna um paint my lips i guess nah kid you must not know about me you must not know about me. Confetti did not get its like get its time. I feel like they need to release a full size of this because the purple reflex in this speak to me. Like they really do. Like I know we made hot chocolate a, like a permanent thing and we did the full size, but like now can we do the rest of them? Cause like every single one of those shades slaps. And I understand it was a holiday collection, but like. I want them all full size all the time anyways um yeah this is the final look i look he pulls it off i feel like i didn't think i had an av i don't think i had an av but like i could take pictures like this i don't know if i would i could go so, you know what i don't want to set this face because i'm about to take it all off but like i feel like maybe it'll erase the texture and just like pull everything together because setting spray normally does let's just go ahead and like saturate the face oh oh Nah, give that a second to dry down because I feel like y'all are not seeing what I'm seeing. Yeah, that was that was it, sis. <laughs> That's pretty much it for this video. I think you thought I forgot, but I definitely did not. So let me say, like, comment, subscribe, share this video, tell a friend to tell a friend, and then of course, bring a friend and see it again. Need some kind of guidance. I need some kind of guidance or direction. I need to know like what it is you guys like and want to see from me. So if you like the more creative artistic things like this where I'm just doing out of the box weird things that like I'm gonna try to pull off, let me know. If you want to just stick to basic makeup and explain how to do it, let me know. I probably won't listen, but at least let me know because that gives me like, you know that gives me direction. Final thoughts on this face, I could definitely go somewhere in it. I could get away with it. It would definitely be passable. Would I intentionally do my makeup like this again? Hell no. Um, I missed my sponge. That's off bats. I missed my sponge. I feel like my under eyes look so crazy because, sorry, I'm just looking at it now, but like, I feel like my under eyes look so crazy because I couldn't, like the way that this tool is built, there's like a, the stopper to the handle is right here. And so like, it doesn't bend the way I need it to, to like fully get under my eyes. Um, the eyes themselves though, they, they came out really cute. I will say that if you're a beginner and you're trying to figure out like placement, you might want to practice with some of the, with some paint brushes because where you put down that brush is where the pigment will be. Okay. And that's just it. Like you saw what happened. The rest of my face, ooh, it took some work. It really did take some work, but I think that if I had a bigger brush to just do like powder, like, 
the powders and my all over face like I think it would have come out cuter but it's definitely wearable like let me give you the see like eventually eventually it blended in but like not the way it could 